Hello devs and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showcasing the Pay Hero Buttons plugin, which will allow you to be able to embed buttons to whichever part of your WordPress website and be able to process payments to receive payments to your till pay bill or your bank account easily. So let me go ahead and show you what exactly you can do with this plugin, all its features, uh, features from short codes uh, to redirect URLs. This is gonna be fun, so lock in. Let's go ahead and do it. So once you install this uh, plugin, you will have this particular link on your sidebar for creating a button. So one more thing that would be important is to open up your Pay Hero and get your Lipo link as well as your channel ID. So if you go into your Pay Hero account, you should be able to find your Lipo link which is usually on your dashboard and the payment channel is the it's the identifier for whichever payment method you have set up to be receiving payments so for this example like this i'm getting my lipo link then i can go ahead and uh, enter it right here for the name of the button this is just for reference so i'm gonna do test uh button like so then for the channel id uh, that's mine the amount I'm just gonna do one, then this I can say Lipa na Mpesa, like so. The color I need it to match my brand. So as you can see, we have this beautiful color picker right here. So I need to match that orange, like so. And then for the success URL, I'm gonna do uh, my sites, like so. And then for failure, I'm gonna do this the uselessweb.com. Just an example, but you can put whatever. And then create a button. So just give it a second and uh, it should generate for you a short code, which you can now embed to be it your blog page for maybe a read more button. I don't know, a donate to me button, a buy an ebook button, whatever you can do. The creativity is really your limit. And then once that has happened, just go ahead and copy this short code. Then I'm gonna have created this payment page as like a showcase. So what I, you need to do is uh, you need to use short codes. So you can just click on this plus element to add a new element with Elementor and just search for short code like so. Just drag it in to wherever. So I'm just gonna put mine right there. And I'm gonna paste that particular short code in there and boom, look at that. And then I'm gonna publish this page just a second published then i'm gonna go and visit that page so let me just refresh this so boom that is it it's right there so let me now go ahead and test this so for the first uh, test i'm gonna cancel the transaction so let's go ahead and click on that so this is gonna bring up a model whereby you enter your phone number and your name otherwise all the other details which will appear will be hard coded from when you created the button and cannot be changed at this point by the by the customer slash visitor on your site so let me just go ahead and enter my phone number like so and the name as you can see this ones are disabled i cannot change and then make payment And as you can hear, that is the SDK push. So let me complete that. Hopefully you could hear that. And I'm done. So the message should be popping up just about now. And there, the redirect is right there, right there. Oh, I, I said I was going to do a field. Okay, okay. So let's, let's try this with a cancel transaction. I should not have completed that one. Let's try that with a canceled transaction. So, okay. So, Lipa na Mpesa.
there's the, the pop-up, let me enter the name, make payments. I think it's just instinct. The moment I saw the push, I completed it. So this time canceled. So I've canceled that one. This time around that is canceled. So as you can see, and we're directed to the useless web. So yeah, that was it. You can find the plugin right about here on this new platform. So this is gonna be also a shameless plug. I have to plug this platform in here real quick. So uh, if you didn't know, I recently launched this platform, which can allow you to be able to sell digital products. I know you guys have digital products. If it could be a template, it could be some music, some MP3, you know, some apps, some ebooks, some audio files, you can go ahead and sell it right here on this site. Don't have to code anything. It will generate for you um, a web front, which is going to be awesome. So just head over here and then click on become a seller today and go ahead and set that up. As you can see, like this is something that is it will create for you. So for example, seller slash fortune check like so as you can see this is my storefront so it will set up something of this uh, particular design for you without actually coding anything whatsoever and then from the dashboard you can be able to come and see how much sales you have made and request a withdrawal from there uh, anytime you need so yeah go ahead and check out the plugin use it click uh, link down in the description tell me uh, what you think about it. And yeah, that was it for this one. I'll see you all in the next video. Peace out.